So here we're just going to show you how to manually boost the Emerson hot water load controller. So from this home screen you see here that at the moment he is um, generating and diverting 1.1 kilowatts to the uh, hot water cylinder. Um, so that's heating away with your excess generation. If you want to fast boost that you can manually force, so with the second button in here you can manually force a boost which will draw full power um, so all that you're generating plus what you're buying off the grid. Obviously at night it'll be all bought off the grid so one push on that button it'll ask you which heater to select and um, we can have two separate elements on that um, so this has only got one element so then we push that button tells you boost um, right here so one hour it'll count down from one hour and you'll see here it'll go up to three kilowatts it's a three kilowatt element and they're buying two kilowatts off the grid now so that means one kilowatt or 1.1 kilowatt coming from excess solar generation a little smiley face has gone um, to a um, not so smiley face because we're buying a bit of power off the grid so that's counting down from one hour you can you can increase that boost just with this button here and the up button that's gone to two hours you can go to four hours so that'll count down until either that time runs out then it'll go back to normal operating mode um, or diverting mode um, or until it gets to hot water thermostat temperature once it reaches thermostat temperature the thermostat in the element switches it off it resets itself so if you go one more from four hours that's all you can do you can count back down two hours one hour 30 minutes 15 minutes um, and 15 minutes is the, the, the smallest boost you can do so from boost once it reaches target temperature it will reset or you can cancel the boost by pushing the X button or the cross and then follow on the screen uh, the tick for cancel boost cancel boost it tells you here boost off and it will go back to standard diverting mode so here now it'll take a minute to catch up um, so now it is it's just thinking about it so now we're putting 1.1 kilowatts um, so we're actually generating close to two kilowatts on the roof it's using about 900 watts doesn't tell us that here but i know that from other from this um, envoy um, we're putting about 900 watts into whatever else is running in the house and we're putting 1.1 kilowatts into the element so that's manual boost